Hello there, Bianca Musudesu and welcome to my unboxing of some booster packs of the new expansion for BT12. So BT12, the new expansion for the Digimon card game, uh, which is Across Time. I've been uh, looking at the cards that the official site has been uh, releasing and announcing and I was really looking forward for this booster expansion because I think it's one of those expansions where I saw so many cards that I want and just to say some before I open up uh, the cards I really want Mermaid Mo, Ancient Mermaid Mo, Ancient Wise Mo um, you also have these really uh, cool alternative art cards with the protagonists of different anime uh, with their um, Digimon and some of the evolutions and but but those are really rare of course uh, so yeah and also you have Biel's mode I don't remember in what mode it's in some mode or X antibody uh, you have a few X antibodies actually uh, in this expansion so yeah I'm really looking forward to see what I may have in this here once again, I bought the booster packs at Arena. I always uh, like to go there, it's super nice, and uh, I'm always able to get this uh, uh, when it's released. And I also have here some cards that I will put on my binder and I will talk later about them because these are some cards that I've been uh, collecting from going there uh, <laughs> almost every week uh, just seeing what cards I still don't have in my collection and buying them individually. So yeah, let's see what we have here. Also, my boyfriend has already uh, opened up four boosters and he has already given me a few of the cards that he had repetitions. Imagine this. Uh, you have 12 cards per booster and he bought four and he only had like seven uh, cards that uh, came out more than once. So let's see what we will have here. Yeah, I won't open the package like it's supposed to because I always get stuck trying to do that. Okay, I have Graulmo. Uh, my, my boyfriend had already given me Gilmo here. So Graulmo. Oh, Cho Hakaimo! It's the, the girl that dresses as uh, a pig. <laughs> a mecha. A mecha uh, that looks like a pig. Meta Life Quagamo. Well, it's epic. I don't really care about the evolution line of Quagamo. Ganemo. Yes, apparently th there are these Digimon that are inspired on Japanese yen. And my boyfriend already has the, the Digimon that are uh, equivalent of 1 yen and 5 yen. Apparently I got the card for 10 yen. I'm rich. Joker Mo, nice. Ah, oh, I wanted this card. Goku Mo, so I can pair him up with... Uh, I forgot her name, doesn't matter. Uh, then we have Potamo. I'm sorry, when I look at this Digimon, I only remember the reboot and the horrible thing. <laughs> I don't know, I, I didn't really enjoy the the episode about uh, potatoes and whatever, eating. Pff, I don't. Ryoma Mogami, no idea who she is and I don't really enjoy um, human characters like i said only when the cards come with also their uh digimon partners ekakimon i already have a, an ekakimon card and this one is really nice burning greymon oh nice this card is awesome rise greymon oh nice and finally davis motomia which has a, a really nice shine to it but once again, I don't really care about the, the human characters unless they were from the, the Digimon Cyber Souls games. Okay, opening up second package. Second booster pack. Another Metal Life Quagamo, which I don't really care. Omni Shoutmo. Uh, my boyfriend had already given me one, but now I have my own. 
Wise Mo, nice. I finally have a Wise Mo card. Potamo, already have that one, so off you go. Oh, okay, so I have now the attack card for Cho Hakaimo, I think that was her name. Hi there, old slot, how are you doing? Thank you so much for the lurk, like I said, we have to appreciate uh, our wonderful lurkers. Thank you so much. So far, it's been lucky, so far, but I don't want to speak too soon. Okay, uh, where am I putting my cards? Wait. Okay, I'm putting there in different places. Oh, Kalmaramo, yes, yes, this card is awesome. I really wanted Kalmaramo. Tuarmo, I don't think I have any of these. Oposumo, I mean, he's cute and I like the card. Torikara Balmo, I guess I'm gonna have the evolution line of the potatoes and hamburger Digimon because I'm feeling hungry apparently. Ooh, Lanamo, yes, ah, oh, this is beautiful. Rice Greymo, so I have another one. Arrested Dramo Superior Mode, oh damn, this one is really nice. Oh, awesome. And let's see what our final pack has in store for us. Forced to wait for Handyman to come and make measurements of my windows to install anti mosquitoes nets. Oh, that's nice. That nice move. Waiting mode, you're loading. <laughs> you're loading while while he doesn't come. It's it's a pain having to wait, but I'm glad that you're going to take measures against the, against the mosquitoes. I also hate mosquitoes. I'm not really worried about being bitten. I, I'm more troubled and annoyed by the sound they make. Because if I have mosquitoes in my house uh, while I'm sleeping, I cannot sleep. Because the, the noise bothers me so much. So much it's not even... Well, it's already hot enough here, so I'm too often visited by bumblebees. Ooh. I'm not really afraid of bumblebees, but being uh, stung by them doesn't sound really nice. Okay, Bergamo, like I said, I don't care about the, the, the goddamn potato and hamburger evolution line, but I have them all. Hey, oh, don't give me this. You give me the attack card for Ancient Wise Mo, but where is Ancient Wise Mo? I want Ancient Wise Mo, not, not his card. Geogremo, okay, I almost have... Oh my god, and you give me the, the attack card for Ancient Mermaid Mo, I swear. If you don't have here Ancient Mermaid Mo and Ancient Wise Mo, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a really bad trip. <laughs> but attack card, another attack card. Jesus, this booster pack is filled with attack cards. Spiral Dragons, which is for... It's not Rice Greymo, I think it's like Imperial Greymo, I don't, I don't know, it's the Mega for that evolution line. Ah, Betsumo, I actually, I don't really appreciate this Digimon, I mean, he looks just plain creepy, but his cards are most of the times really funny and interesting in the vibe they have. Hi there, Metalhead, how are you doing? So, I do like, okay, I have another Chohakaimo, so here you go. Lumpumo. Oh, I finally have um, the, the, the the genie from <laughs> from Aladdin <laughs> as a Digimon. Cosenimo, like I said, it's the from that um, evolution line of the Japanese yen. Apparently, that's a thing now. Oh, Psychmo. Psychmo has a really beautiful art in this booster pack. Although, of course, it's due to them bumblebees being able to heat up themselves to 40 degrees, which gives them advantage, although they get out later. Oh, bumblebees are out there and get all the things. I mean, you have to, to take the early bird, right? A rainy start to the day, which is okay. How are you? Really, here it's just sunny all around. I mean, there are a few clouds, but doesn't seem like it will rain any anytime soon. Psychmo, so, oh my god, this is a really beautiful attack card, but not really sure who the Digimon is actually, but it's really, it's really awesome. And another kid uh, from, I think this one is from the, no, I, I won't say it because I, I, I have no idea. 
I'm good, I'm great. As you can see, I'm doing an extra stream to open up and did you see three booster packs and like what? Three, four cards that were uh, repetitions? I'll be happy to take all the rain from you since rain will prevent insects to get to my windows. <laughs> we understand you. Okay, so our booster packs are open. I think next week I will probably, I won't stream again, of course, opening up booster packs. I'm really, I'm, the only thing I'm sad about is they give me the attack cards for Ancient Wise Moon and Ancient Mermaid Moon, but they don't give me neither. Why? I wanted those cards so badly. But let me show you also the cards that I've been collecting these few days. This is the pride of my recent uh, collection. So I have here uh, Magna Dramo and this card is just beautiful all around. Here we have Shoutmo. Shoutmo has a lot of different versions. So we have here Shoutmo X5B. So it's another one because I have X4, X4B. I have an, a lot of them different. Here you have an Asuramo. Asuramo is interesting, and now whenever I look at Asuramo, I will always remember that uh, episode in Ghost Game where Asuramo steals the faces of kids. That was creepy. But then he decided to steal Hiro's, the protagonist's face. And Hiro likes to help people, so they asked the Hiro's face to stop stealing other people's faces. And he was like, okay, because Hiro can't reject uh, helping other people. <laughs> that was so funny and then Asuramo proceeded to actually be their friend and support them in in some episodes take some I like rain instead of snow you wait do you prefer rain or snow I, I got kind of confused Clavis Angemo so here we have another this is Angemo if you went to Kingdom Hearts I'm, I'm joking uh, but Clavis Angemon, the card is really awesome. Ah, yes, I'm trying to collect the the evolution line of Vimo from this uh, girl here because I know she appears in quite a few games. Another Triceramo, I already have one, but this one is cute. He is eating some. I don't know what this is. This this looks like it's growing uh, on the ground, but doesn't look like grass. It doesn't look like bushes either, so not sure. Ah yes, this attack card. This attack card is awesome, awesome. I just like the art; is amazing. Hey, wait. Why 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 aren't you near Vidramo? This one the same evolution so let me put it here before i of course agomo with the protagonist of world next order i think bushi agomo which is another version for agomo agomo has a lot of variants dracomon this card is also really well done i have a few dracomon cards actually Gingakumo, so I can put it next to King Kakumo, which is once again they kind of pair up. Ooh, I forgot I had this one, which is Metal Greymon plus the Cyber Launcher. I mean, the card almost you can almost only see the attack that he's doing, but the card is really well done and the design is epic. This one also, I like the art for the attack, Demonic Disaster. Of course, you couldn't miss having a, a Koromo. I like this Koromo, although he seems like he's in a very stressful situation, like he's in some kind of lab. And let me put Koromo near the Agumon cards. Where are the Agumon cards? Yes. Ah, yes, another art for Panjiamo. I really like Panjamon designs and actually if you remember I'm gonna this is this has a really great timing because later tonight I will be playing Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Uh, I'm going back to the game because I have Royal Knights to defeat. And actually I'm this expansion is about Royal Knights. Why don't I have a single Royal Knight? What do you mean? But I have a Panjamon right now in my team. 
Then you have these very epic. Um, wait, what is this? Uh, Rise Greymo? I don't know. He doesn't even have. Look, look at this Greymo, Greymo, uh, War Greymo, whatever variant. He doesn't have a six pack. He has like a twelve pack. What's this? What is even this? What's this anatomy? Can you tell me? Ah yes. Tactical retreat. Tactical retreat cards are always so fun and so uh, they are just amazing. Ah yes, an attack card for Leomo, Fist of the Beast King. And today I was able to grab this Wargreymo, which I, I, I think the only thing I have is a black Wargreymo, so have a, a Wargreymo for me, and a Matadormo. So yeah, and now my problem here is I have a lot of cards. I don't know what I'm going to do with the kids. I know I got the human cards. Oh, and also the cards that didn't uh, I didn't get, but my boyfriend gave me. Uh, no, Omni Shoutmo, I don't need him. Pilomo. Pilomo is so cute and she's sleeping with Gatomo and Labramo and so many cute babies. And Gilmo, because I got the Graumo but not Gilmo. Continuing on with the hamburger slash potato evolution line. Otamamo, which I don't really, it's not one of those babies that I really enjoy but I mean the card is a lot of fun and it's really nice ah yes because I really want the Japanese yen evolution line I'm so looking forward to the mega <laughs> and this one this one is Impmo X antibody yes this one this one takes the cake so yeah, we have a lot to uh, put here. Once again, I'm not really sure. I got two shiny cards for protagonists, but I'm not sure what I would be doing with them. I mean, I guess since I have them, I might as well put them. So let me check what I have here. So coins, Otamamo is a whole different matter. Let me put Impomo here. Hamburger, Gilmo, Pilomo. Pilomo is also a whole different matter. Overflowing power. I have no idea what Digimon this is, but I don't have it. That's plain as day. Psychmo will go next to Gabumo, of course. Where is Lumpmon going? No idea. Betsumo, I already have a Betsumo, so that's solved. Pyro Dragons, it's related to the variants of uh, an Agumo Evolution line. Ancient Mermaid Moon will be waiting for me to get a, an actual Ancient Mermaid Moon. Yeah, so I will join her... Mm. Geo Grimo, I have... I'm building the Evolution line I have here. Ancient Wise Mo, once again. Okay, but uh, I have Abby Burgamo and Bergamo. Okay, so that's like an evolution line. Arrester uh, Dramo. I have no idea where this is gonna go. I mean, the card is epic and I want it, but no idea for what. And I think this this two go together. I feel like Lanamo, which I'm gonna put near Calamarmo. Tori Carabalmo, which is more hamburger like. Oposumo. I feel like putting Oposumo near Betsumo for some reason. Tuarmo. Where am I gonna put that? Nobody knows. I'm good. How are you, Metalhead? How are you doing? I'm just trying to organize all these cards to see more or less because my binder follows a logic and right now I'm trying to... At least I have Wisemo. So I know that ancient the, the ancient wise mon attack will go near that. I mean the ancient mermaid mon will go near the calamar mon evolution line. Omni shout mon. I know where I have to put omni shout mon. What am I going to do with metal life quagamo? Well, I do have uh, a tentomo. 
Just figuring out what to play. What are your options? By the way. Okay, so I have here the Growl Moon. Here I have the... Where am I going to put the big girl? I have no idea where I'm, where I'm going to put that. It's not that I don't like the card. I just don't know what to do with it. Oh, yes. I have another Metal Life Quagamo. So, nope. Ah, yes. More for my con coin evolution line. Ganemo. Joker Mo. No idea where I'm going to put that. But Gokumo, I know where I'm going to put. Potato Mo, it's going to go near the hamburger. More. Ekaki Mo also has a place. Burning Grey Mo and Rice Grey Mo. Okay. Nice. Okay. And now, here we go. This Omni Shot Mo, I have to put it near. Let me put Matardamo, yeah, near these ones. Now I have here Wargrimu. I don't know. Red Rimmer, is it Rice Grimu? Burning Grimu? No? No version. I have no idea. But he is near these ones. I mean, Panjamo should be near the Leomo. This is obviously for Maggie Dramu. Metal Greymo, so you also have to go here. Koromo, yeah, now this all is for here. Tricera, Triceramo is kind of uh, apart. A lot. I bought 17 retro games and I haven't finished any. Well, join the club. I, I, it's not retro games, but I have a lot of games to play and I don't play them. Start from alphabetical order. Usually your mind will tell, nah, it's not what I want. Until you'd reach one which you are ready to give it a go. True, that's a good plan. That's a good plan. Because if you feel like delaying, then you are not really interested. Ooh, here is the other. Where, where was the Omni Shot Mo? Nobody knows. I've lost Omni Shot Mo. Here it is. Okay. I think I have some semblance of order, although I'm not sure where I'm gonna put a lot of these Pyro Dragons. This is gonna be chaos. Chaos. Maybe Otamamu? Yeah, why not? Chohakamo. Ah, Tuarmo. Which I have no idea where to put. Okay, we have all these cards to put in the binder. Let's start, shall we? Okay. So. Yeah, this is already... I'm gonna have to start right at the beginning changing cards because Betsumo is right here. I'm pretty sure I don't have enough... Yeah, I don't have enough... Uh, this is too many cards for me to, to put away, but let's see how this will go. So, already have to take away this one, Betsumo, because I want to put Opusumo... Where is that? Okay. And this one will come here. Yes. And now let's take all our Gatomons. Let's take a moment to appreciate how many different Gatomon cards I have, shall we? I have three, six, seven Gatomon cards. I don't need that. <laughs> well, I do need them because I like them, but... 
I have seven different Gatomon cards. I mean, not obsessive at all. Okay, so I will put this Betsumo and then this one and now Gatomo all my Gatomon cards and I also have one two one two three four five even if I don't count the attack card I have five different un Angeomon cards once again, not obsessive at all. And I'm actually disappointed because I was so happy that I was able to get this one, which has Mire and Nanjiomo on the last booster pack, but I wasn't able to get Lady Devimo with Mire. But this one is so rare. I mean, I think this one was for all the booster packs I bought. Tony Hawk it is. My mind is made up. Tony Hawk. Whoa. And now I have four different cards of Magna Dramo. Let me see where I put my Magna Dramo card. Where are you, Magna Dramo? Where did I put you? You are hidden. Okay, Magna Dramo. Just before the Magna Dramo X antibody card. No, no, uh, actually, this art has um, uh, Angeomo in it, so it will be uh, near Angeomo. Okay. And by the way, if you want to see any one of these close up, just say the word. I mean, let's all appreciate for a second there. Angelmo. Beautiful, right? They do very beautiful arts for Angelmo. This one was the one I was most proud of. Look at this card. I just love it. And now I have this one to pair it up with. And then I also have here Black Gatomu. But of course, Black Atomo and uh, Lady Devimo are really hard to come by, so I don't have a lot for them. Love is Angemon will go soon here because I have the Angemon evolution line.
and I only have two, well with the attack card three, but two mass demon cards, but they are both so beautiful. So I'm already happy. I also have like six Patamo cards. Patamo is cute. Now putting the Angemons, actually I really like this art, this is one of my favorite Angemon cards because I think this one is really nice. Now Pidomon, and I'm gonna put uh, Clavizangemon around here, yes, okay. And I also have a here uh, Justice Mo, Justy Mo, not Justice. Oops, took away the two cards. And here we come to the Sister Moon cards. Eosmo also has a very interesting evolution line.
I wonder if I should put the tactical retreat card near Salamu because Salamu is one of the Digimon that is doing the tactical retreat. Now we arrive at Lopamu. And here I have a Pilomo, which I'm gonna add the new Pilomon card that I have. Pilomo here, really cute. And now cute mo. I wanted to have the Shadow Beam on Virus, but I was only able to get the normal Shadow Beam, which I like, don't get me wrong, but I would also like to have the Virus one. And now we are in Angoramon's Evolution line. I want the other bit more. And now Floramo and all the plant-based evolutions, a lot of different palmons. Toropiamo actually has some really interesting cards. The the art for Toropiamo is really nice.
and Lily Mall. Each time a card comes out, it's just beautiful. Bancho de Limon is another one I really like. Ravel Simon, Lotos Mon, and of course I have also Lila Mon. And I'm keeping a space for Bloom Lord Mon, but that's kind of tough. Can you imagine? I tried to ask for the price. I know it was a full art, but I tried to ask for the price of a Bloom Lord Moon card. And that card was actually took a while to be sold because the card was like 20 something euros. Just so expensive. I mean, each booster pack costs 5 euros. Imagine a card being worth 4 or 5 booster decks. Ah, now I found it. Uh, I have here my Ekakimo um, card. So let me bring the other one I have now. Ekakimo, Ekakimo. Here he is. Nice. I will still make space for the Bloom Lord Moon card I will never get. Okay, so I have the, the Tento Moon card. You know, it's kind of stupid because I actually picked up um, an Ethical Kabuteri Moon attack card, but I don't have one an Ethical Kabuteri Moon. <laughs> But I just, I just thought the card looked so, so epic that I wanted to have it. Okay, now an Ekakimo card that I have. Now Wormmon's evolution line. I'm still waiting for my Vangado. I want my hoodie mo. OK, 
okay the attack card and now I have to find that metal life I think it was something like that yeah metal life quagamu let me see how that is <coughs> and now Beomon's evolution line I also wanted the rest of these girl, this pink haired girl cards because I only have Birdramo and Garudamo. <coughs> so I wanted more. Okay, and here we have the evolution line for Falco Moon that I wanted to collect after playing Survive. And of course, Sylphie Moon. Sylphie Moon is another fusion I was able to get in Cyber Sleuth. I feel like I played Hacker's Memory, and the grind is so much easier to do. I was able to get a lot of Digimon that I wanted. And I feel like I'm ending this uh, cyber and I'm not going to get any of the Digimon that I want. Ah, yes, we have here Siren Moon, Dark Moon, Sanzo Moon, and now next to Sanzo Moon, I'm, got, I'm gonna put Goku Moon. Yes, because he pairs up with her, and another another uh, Digimon I'm saving space for is Venus Mom because I wasn't able to get a single card for her
Ah, only now I'm noticing that in, in Sanzo Moon card there's also Cho Hakai Moon and another Digimon I have never seen. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, so maybe I'm gonna put Sho Hakaimo near them. Because I had no really really no place to put them. So so yeah. Gonna do that. Okay, wait. Let me look for the Sho Hakaimo cards. Here she is. Let me just... Mm, but I feel like they don't fit, so maybe not. Yeah. Salamo. Salamo is here running with Patamo. And since they are running, I'm gonna put Tactical Retreat. Makes perfect sense. I mean, it's even Salamo and Patamo in Tactical Retreat, so of course I'm gonna put them right here. Nice. Couldn't have planned that out better. Okay, and now I will also take the opportunity that we have here the evolution line for Jellymo. Well, I actually have the evolutions of Jellymo and not Jellymo. And I will put Calamarmo. Yes. Leaving a space for Ancient Mermaidmo. <laughs> I cry. Yes. And right after that we have Siakomo. By the way, if you go to my gallery in my coffee, I have added there my some Digimon cosplay. So I've added Angeomo, Lady Devimo, Sakuyamo, and also some human characters because I've added uh, the protagonist of Cyber Sleuth and um, Mire. I mean, I feel like Mire shouldn't be too hard to cosplay. Her clothing is interesting, but not really uh, special or different from stuff you see in daily life. Now, doing the protagonist would be a challenge, because uh, the clothing has some specific patterns.
I'm increasing my aquatic Digimon. And of course, one of my favorite parts also of my collection, Renamon's Evolution Line. I don't know if there is a card for it, but I would love to actually have a Kuzuhamo card. Which is the dark version of of Taomo, if I'm not mistaken, or Sakuyomo. I feel like, oh, I actually forgot that I already have an Ancient card because I have an Ancient Sphinx move and I think I have other stuff that I'm not remembering. A lot of Ghost Mo cards and Ghost Mo attack cards. By the way, the Cyber Sleuth has a problem because sometimes they they call the Eaters Bakemon and I'm a, a little bit confused because there is a Digimon called Bakemon so you are calling Eaters a Digimon that's not a, an Eater And it's not a, a matter of mistranslation because they they do say that the the voice actors they say Bakemo when referring when they are talking about eaters. The first time that appeared, I was really confused because I was like, "But what Bakemo? Where is the Bakemo you're talking about?" And then I understood they were talking about the eaters. Actually, I don't remember if Pakemo is a Digimon you can obtain in Cyber Sleuth. I have no idea, actually. And of course, the huge number of wizard moons that I have. Actually, I've never seen a sorcery moon uh, card, which is the ice variant of wizard moon. I'm not sure if there is one.
I also have a few Devimon cards. Uh, I feel like it's a shame I wasn't able to get the, the Drachmon card because I'm here saving space for the Drachmon because I have a, um, an attack card for him. Here. Have done the Vimon for your appreciation. It's a really epic card. And if you want the Cthulhu reference, here you have. He has an attack card, uh, which is called Forbidden Trident. And here I am with my Miotismon cards. I feel like I have the same number or even more attack cards than Miotismon. Yeah, I have one Miotismon card, but three related <laughs> attack cards. Which is kind of bonkers. I feel like putting Matador Moon. Let me check. Actually, this is actually a, a nice way to go about it. Mm. Oh, my Devimon cards. I have by now four cards. Here and I think now I'm gonna put this ones. Yes, I'm gonna put the coins here, and now I'm gonna take Golomo.
and here I have also my shot moons and then all those uh, variants that he has with the um, the shot mo X something so I have here X3 X4 X4B and now I have X5B X5B and this Omni Shout Moon that is going next to the other Omni Shout Moon because I have another art of Omni Shout Moon and I also have Omni Shout Moon X antibody. And there I have the Hakmo Evolution line, a few Jesmo also. So the, the coins are Cosenimo, Zenimo and Ganimo. And the Mega is a bill <laughs> instead of a coin. Gunkomo. Now that I'm playing Cyber Sleuth, I'm gonna learn a little bit more about Gunkomo because I have already found Gunkomo uh, talking with Hukmo. Due to the cards, I already knew they had uh, some kind of plot related to each other. And we're going into the field of Agumon. Huh, I already had the War Greymon card. Oh well.
Okay, so I have here Metal Greymon and I have another Metal Greymon related card. Yeah, let's take away all this. These are all related to the Agumo Evolution line. Actually, yeah, let me put this one here. Bushi Agumo will go somewhere else. This Agumo will also go somewhere else. And Metal Grimon Cyber Launcher. Yes, okay. Sai Greymon. And let's go for Black War Greymon. War Greymon. I have to take away the card. Uh, where is War Greymon? Huh. Where did I put the War Greymon card, actually? Pyro Dragons is here. What did I do with it? Oh, here it is. Uh, did I get another burning Grimo? Or I didn't get burning? Geo burning. I don't have any Geo Grimon, right? Nope. I don't have Geo Grimon. No, I do have Geo is there. Okay. Okay. Burning, burning. Okay, Victory Greymon, and then we have here Agumon, Yellow Memory Boost, and we can put Toy Agumon, Bushi Agumon, Snow Agumon. I will put this Agumo here in the middle and now this one and then I have Geo and these variants, I have nowhere to put them. These attack cards that I don't have anything to do with them. Where is the Gaia Force thing? Gaia Force. Yeah, this one.
Okay, and now Red Memory Boost. Geo Grimo. I have another Geo Grimo. I will put like this, maybe. Geo Grimo. Geo Grimo. Or maybe behind Rise Grimo. And then this Rise Grimo. And Shine Grimo. And then I have these two cards, which are not related to any of the evolutions I have, because none of these ones are equal to this. Yeah. Okay, and then we are going into Gilmon's territory, which I also have a Gilmon and a Growlmon. Let me see where I have that. Gilmon and Growlmon. Here they are. And actually, yes, like this. Because Gilmo in one in the card that came in this booster across time, uh, he is protecting a Koromo. So many Grawlmons. Actually, the one of the evolutions I have less cards is for War Grawlmon. Switching these ones. Yeah, I think this makes more sense. Okay, Maggie Dramo is here. And I have like an attack card to put near it. Megidramo, Megido Flame, and Demonic Disaster. Dramo, Dark Dramo.
my sort of like Digimon. Okay, I have here an Asuramo and now I have another to put right next to this one. Asuramo. Here he is. Hmm, I should have put Wise Moon next to Wizard Moon. God damn it, I forgot that. Well, I will have to leave it at the end. And put that another time, I guess. Yeah, we'll have to put that right at the end and leave it for another time. Only now did I think of that. A lot of Metamon, Blue Metamon, Skull Metamon. They are always amazing cards. Okay, so Yamon and we are now in Impumon's evolution line. I have an Impumon card, so let me go get that. Here he is, it's the X antibody. So all the other Impumons take precedence. X antibody and BL's move. And a lot more Bielsmo. I'm so happy with all the Bielsmo cards I was able to get with the card deck. And of course, Bielstarmo.
and I also have here Minerva Moon. This is a really nice card. And here we have Ginkakumo, which we're gonna pair up with Ginkakumo. And we also have here the Leomon, so let me take this out. Mad Leomon, Leomon, Attack Card, Fist of the Beast King, Tactical Retreat, Panjiamon, another Panjiamon, and Panjiamon Accent I Body, Leomon, Leomon. Okay, I have nothing for this part because this is Gomamon's evolution line and some others. Only now I'm noticing I only have one blue metamo. Okay, now I have here Gabumu and maybe I'm gonna put Psychmo, let me see, Psychmo, 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 Tsunomo, yeah, Psychmo and then Gabumu.
Okay. Okay, everything here is just Baluchi Moon, Mammoth Moon, Skull, Mammoth Moon, so these cards. And we're soon gonna enter the Vimon evolution line. Oh, I thought I didn't have the, the Vimon girl, but apparently I already have this card. So what I didn't have was the Vidra Moon one. Okay, so maybe I will change up the order. Female armor. Female this one. Take this one out. Vimu, Vimu and Vidramu, and more Vidramu. Okay. Ah yes, who force Vidramo, which we are gonna he was basically killed in the dimensional door, but we are gonna go get all force Vidramo from another reality or another uh, possible universe so we can defeat in a race <laughs> Well, we can defeat the speed of Kentaru's move. Okay, so I have another Dracomo that I'm gonna put here. Let me see. Okay. And this is actually gonna be my fourth Dracomon card. Dracomo? Hmm. Interesting, but this one has a different coloring So they are all blue Yes, and this one is red Dracomo, 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 let's put it like this I guess And let's keep going, Coredramo
Okay, there is Triceramon. Now I can put it near that one. And this one is green, so I can put near the Dino memory boost. Triceramon. And the other three ceremon card I have. Okay, I still have the attack card for Skullgrimo, still waiting for a Skullgrimo card. Machine Dramo. This Machine Dramo is just amazing. We are now in Gamma Moon's Evolution line, also a few Pulse Moon cards. I will still say, Pulse Moon just makes me uh, think of Gamma Moon. I feel like the, the design of their faces is kind of similar. All the evolutions for Gamamo. The Pikmons and Starmons all here too. I have a Tuar Moon card, so I'm going to pair this one up with this. Tuar Moon, Tuar Moon.
I'm still not sure where I'm gonna put all the potatoes and hamburger Digimon. I'm just going with this and see where it's gonna lead me. Because by now, uh, if I forget the Wisemon card that I forgot to put uh, near Wizard Mo, so I'm putting it at the very end so I can remember next time. Um, I'm only missing, I think, the the food Digimon. Every time I see that album, I'm impressed with the sheer size of it and how much it filled. If you are surprised by my album, believe me, I'm a lot pickier than my boyfriend, for example. My boyfriend has a... <laughs> has like... he has double what I have. So if you, if you think I have a lot of cards, <laughs> you should really see how many he has. Because I'm, uh, I've already said this, in, sometimes in my selection of Digimon, I make the very girly decisions. I'm, I go most of the times for the humanoid-like Digimon. Um, of course, there are a few that are not like that that I, enjo and that I enjoy for some reason or other. But my boyfriend, besides enjoying the humanoid ones, he also enjoys a lot of the monsters that I don't. And the insect-like evolutions, all that. So, yeah, he has a lot of cards. So can you imagine how many cards in total there are? <laughs> it's not even a number uh, that you can picture. After a certain point, it's just a lot, no matter how much of a difference between two, a lot there is. Yeah, after a certain point, it's just a lot. And imagine people that collect the cards. Hi there, the bait. Thank you so much for the lurk. How are you? Uh, and imagine the people that collect the cards, not because of... Uh, I mean, one day, uh, I think there is an app uh, for you to learn the basics of the trade card game, so you can play. But imagine people that collect the cards for competition reasons. Those people, ha uh, besides having more or less one card of each, they sometimes have more than one card, so they have the same card uh, twice, uh, three times, four times, because they need it from a competitive point of view, because uh, you need the rules, you know, of I've never played any trade card game. Uh, I do want to learn the rules. Because I would like, even though I like collecting the cards, I would also enjoy to be able to play. I'm not saying I'm really interested in competitions, although sometimes the, the prizes in competitions are really... Uh, they are... because they, they give you exclusive cards that otherwise are really difficult to come by. Uh, I remember there was this tournament where the the card they gave the winner was uh, Sakuyamo Miku Mode. I want that card so badly because I love, like I said, I love Renamon's uh, evolution line and I really like Sakuyamo and I like her Miku Mode, which is the, the a version where she is dressed like... Um, uh, like a priestess, you know? Okay. Okay, now it's the point where I'm gonna have to think where I'm gonna put this. And 
and stuff for the cards are always coming out uh, now it's this booster pack and as you could see I was able to get like let's say I opened three booster packs so a total of 36 cards and some of them were uh, like five or six so in total I had 30 different cards but this booster pack lets you get around uh, I think the booster pack even says it's around 112 car different cards so imagine that you have I only was able to get 30 out of 112 I'm not saying I want all the cards but in this booster pack I want most of them so it's like a collection of a hundred cards for me to make Now the, the process will be faster because I have no more cards to take out, it's just putting them in. Okay, I think I'm gonna put them here. I mean, this is the hamburger, hamburger, hamburger. Yeah, okay, so. For now, Lampamo, I have no idea where I'm gonna put him. Actually, I was mistaken. I have enough space for all the cards. Nice. And, of course, my shame. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put Lampamo. I also have here uh, Reserdramo. 
and of course why is moon that it's not a matter of me not knowing where i'm gonna put it i just forgot to put it next to wizard moon so yeah there we have it let's go back to the beginning you can see <laughs> all the cards here and i'm still not sure what i'm going to do about this like i said what i wanted was the um the cards that have the kids with the digimon partners that's what i wanted although i know this one is for gilmo and this one is for not sure not sure that one but i know that one is for gilmo let me actually i was gonna close but let me put these ones at the end like here okay yes so yeah it's finished uh i will probably buy more boosters because there are still a lot of cards that i'm missing a lot of cards that my boyfriend was able to get on his booster packs and i wasn't able to he didn't get that many uh repetitions in the cards and neither did i so i will probably buy a few more but as soon as it starts to have too many cards that are the same we will probably stop i mean there's so many cards i wanted to have from the uh, the previous expansion and i wasn't able to get them at all because we started buying boosters and at a certain point there were can you imagine buying a booster with 12 cards and 10 are cards you already have I, you feel like you are just wasting money so even though there were a lot of cards that we wanted and didn't have uh, we basically just gave up on buying those and we will probably do the same with this new booster pack let's see how lucky <laughs> we are in choosing those ones but yeah even though i'm gonna continue buying the booster packs this i always do only one stream like presenting the booster packs and then i'm gonna just collect the cards put adding them to my binder as i go and probably the next time you will see something related to digimon cards will be i hope uh the next uh card deck that they do i'm not sure if it's mass demo or if it's another one uh, but i hope it's something related to that so Thank you so much everyone that showed up, thank you so much for keeping me company, I hope you have a good rest of afternoon and I will see you later for more Digimon. So may music always be your life force.